Hello, my name is Danny. My name is Adam, and we're first year students studying at the University of Portsmouth. So today we're going to be hopefully answering some of your questions and explaining our experience of our first year at the University of Portsmouth. So we've both moved away from home at quite a young age um, to study. Um, initially we were feeling quite scared, um, nervous, but really excited to start studying. Um, the university was really, really supportive um, with that. They offered opportunities such as joining clubs and societies, um, doing some meet-up days, um, loads of freshers events for new students who was feeling um, uh, the same, which is really, really helpful to meet new people. Um, also, the course team is really, really good um, in providing support and opportunities um, to settle on the university life. And also, SCAS, um, who you were doing your placement with, was also really good. And if you have any concerns um, about anything, they're always on hand to help with that. So one of the main questions we get asked a lot is whether we would recommend going into university halls or going straight into a shared house. So we both went straight into university halls, which we both really, really enjoyed. They both have their pros and cons. Um, main benefits of university halls are that they're really good to make new friends. So widening your social circle and also they're really convenient because they're situated right next to the university lecture building so they're really really convenient uh, we also get asked a lot about parking because it is essential to have your car down in portsmouth for the paramedic science course because you need it to get to and from placement um, we have both managed to get parking in halls of residence it is possible however it is cheaper if you're uh, in a shared house but either way is possible so we also really are enjoying the course. Um, we love the variety of different te teaching techniques. Yeah, so there's loads of different teaching techniques, whether that be demonstrations, um, lectures, seminars, practical days. Yeah, the list goes on really. Um, we're also taught from a variety of different professionals. It's not just um, paramedics, who is what our course team is made up of. Um, we're taught by radiographers. We're taught by um, heart paramedics, we're taught by midwives, nurses. Hand paramedics, yeah. a massive variety. Uh, the university facilities are also really good for our course. We have simulation centres that we can put our uh, lecture, the information we've learnt from a lecture, we can put into practice in the simulation suite. And then you're obviously out on placement and using those skills on real patients acting as student paramedics. Yeah, for example, one day we could be learning um, airway management in university lecture, the next day we could be practicing in the sim suite, and then potentially the next week we could actually be putting them skills to use um, on a real life patient on placement, which really enhances your skills as a student. So some of the opportunities that we're going to talk about you can do outside the course. Um, currently in this pandemic, we're doing patient transport with SCAS, so we're currently employees. Um, which is really, really good. Do you agree? Yeah, it's been really, really good. And we're really lucky to have been able to have this opportunity. Um, I know that some of our paramedic cohort have also um, been working in the 111 call taker. Um, and they've just been able to offer us loads of different opportunities so that despite not being able to go out on placement, they have found us positions within uh, SCAS, which has been really, really good. Yeah, it's been really helpful and helps um, keep up our skills as well. Um, yeah. So hopefully that's answered some of your questions. Um, yeah, so best of luck if you are applying. We yeah. would really recommend it. We've really enjoyed our first year. We can't wait for second year. Yeah, really look forward to it. So best of luck and hopefully see you all in September. Yeah, good luck everyone.